I love your movies and mute. I'm sorry, what? Can't hear. Going through. Tunnel. Think. Lost. Hey, howdy, hey, y'all. Allison here, and today we are going to be reading some of my favorite Rick Riordan tweets. So let's get started, my dudes. Do you want Heroes of Olympus to be filmed? I'd rather it be red, thanks. Watching Sea of Monsters, frustrated how inaccurate the movies are from the books. Raising the question, why are you watching it? Are you ever relieved you didn't go see the movies? I'd be even more relieved if people stopped asking me about them. Thoroughly sorry for the great injustice done to you and your fans through the Percy Jackson movies. Easy remedy, don't watch them. Favorite Percy Jackson movie? Anyone they don't make is my favorite. Will you ever watch the movies after you're done writing Percy Jackson? Why would I? You think they'll get better with age? Makes me wonder why you sold the movie rights. Yeah, wouldn't it be nice if you could only buy lottery tickets you knew would win? You could at least try watching the movies. Mm, if a moldy sandwich looks disgusting, are you curious to taste it to make sure? Finally, I still have not seen the movies, and don't plan on ever doing so. I judge them from having read the scripts, because I care most about the story. I certainly have nothing against the very talented actors, not their fault. I'm just sorry they got dragged into that mess. I'm mystified why anyone would want more adaptations after what we've had. It's like, please punch me again, it might not hurt this time. It's refreshing to see that Uncle Rick hates the Percy Jackson movies as much as we do. Well, to you guys, it's a couple hours of entertainment. To me, it's my life's work going through a meat grinder when I pleaded with them not to do it, so yeah, but it's fine, all fine. We're gonna fix it soon. Um, is anyone else's Disney Plus censoring the Lightning Thief Lotus casino scene? I have the kid-friendly setting off, so why are they still censoring it? Rick Riordan is my favorite scene, and the only reason I turned on the movie. I don't know, but clearly it's a mistake. They should censor the entire thing. Just two hours of blank screen. <laughs> Three major types of fans. Those who complain I kill everyone, those who complain I kill no one, and those who complain that somehow I do both. Apollo's got 99 problems, but his sexuality ain't one. You're not planning to kill anyone in Beloved Olympus, right? Discreetly hides Chainsaw. Who? Me? Why, why do you ask? <laughs> I dreamed I was the Roman goddess of cleaning. Is there a goddess of cleaning? I don't know, but I wish she'd come to my house. New strategy to avoid cliffhangers. End each book with, they lived happily ever after. Start each book with, oh wait, no they didn't. What inspires you to write often? Deadlines. I am taking night classes in fangirl as a second language. Sorry for any mistakes. This lol dies. How's that fangirling course going for you? I can't even- if, <laughs> I'm just curious, what Hogwarts house are you in? None of them. The Sorting Hat sent me straight to Argus Filch's office to save time. And here we have my favorite writer, Rick Riordan. Ah, uh, yes, you found my glamour shot. I want to be an author. Does that mean I have to break millions of hearts like you? <laughs> it's good to have goals. Will Piper be less useless in Blev Olympus? Oh, I'm sorry. Did she not kill enough goddesses for you? What most irritates you about 21st century life? Compared to when I grew up, 2014 is awesome. The good old days sucked. Happy Rosh Hashanah to my Jewish fans. Blow that groovy ram's horn, y'all. Is it true we will get Nico's point of view in Bell of Olympus? Who told you that? Oh, wait, I did, like four hours ago. Yes, true. Uncle Rick, can you name Nico's girlfriend after me? Honey, she gay. If Percy and Annabeth have a child, is it demigod or just human? Mm. Could be a horse, you never know with mythology. If Percy and Annabeth get married and have three kids, would they be the Jackson Five? You're assuming Annabeth would take his last name. Why aren't all seven heroes there on the cover of Blood Olympus? We've never shown more than three demigods on any cover. Where are, where are the Greek part of the seven? They're inside the book. Do you have lunch with other authors and laugh as you plot another death of a fictional character? Maybe. You really like answering no, right? Yes. Someone on Instagram asked what Percy Jackson fans are called. I believe the correct term is long-suffering. Are you going to mess with Percybeth? Uh, that's kind of my entire career. Which is your favorite couple in the series? Falico is a work of genius, to be honest. Will Tartarus seems to be 18 plus? Since I write middle grade novels aimed at ages 8 to 14, I'd have to go with No, are you crazy? Favorite ship? In my own books, the Argo 2. Not in my books, the Titanic. That is what you meant, right? What's your opinion on non-canon shipping? 
I think most shipping these days can be done without the use of cannons. I love your movies and mute. I'm sorry, what? Can't hear. Going through. Tunnel. Think. Lost. Me and my friends are arguing about which of the seven will die in I would never my characters. Can you tell us something we can expect from Blood Olympus? Nouns. Also a fair number of verbs. We have a saying in Texas, when a horse dies, get off. How much do you earn per book you write? Three Oreos with milk. My agent negotiated for the milk. If you ever kill Nico D'Angelo, I will hunt you down and steal your Oreos and- NO ONE THREATENS MY OREOS! If you make a happy ending for Nico, I'll reward you with 12 goats. Hmm, a fine offer, but I'm afraid my pet Hydra would eat them. What's your Hydra's name? Peanut. Do you eat the hopes and dreams of children for breakfast? That, or Raisin Bran, I like to mix it up. Ah oh, yes, the occasional, why did you put gender fluidity in your books? Your agenda is ruining the story, comment. Perhaps what is ruining the story for that reader is their insistence on believing that a non cishet character's right to exist in a story is an agenda. And of course, if the reader is wondering why I put gender fluidity in a Norse mythology story, that reader doesn't know much about Norse mythology. To the person who couldn't read my books anymore because the inclusion of non-heteronormative characters went against his Christian beliefs. That's fine. I muted you because reading such unchristlike tweets goes against my Christian beliefs. Merry Christmas. Here you go, random commenter. I fixed it for you, and thanks for your concern, but I am quite happy with my sales. Hashtag all kids deserve representation. All right, guys, let's break this down. If you had less gender dysphoria, zero acknowledgement that some kids are not straight and cisgender, in your kids' books, books that include marginalized people I don't want my children to know about until they are 18, you might sell more a piece homophobic adults who think gender identity is contagious. Remember, it is parents who buy them. Mm -mm, model bigotry for their kids. Just turned down an invite to be honored by Texas State Legislature as a Texas author. If they want to honor me, they could stop this nonsense. So Greeks fight more slashy slashy, whereas the Romans fight more stabby stabby? You have learned all I can teach you. OMG, Riordan means royal poet in Irish. Is this some kind of coincidence or? No, I plan to be born with that name. Do you visit all the places you talk about in your books? Most I've been to. Not all. Never been to Tartarus. Uncle Rick, what genre of music does Nico listen to? The howls of tormented souls through the poplar trees of Asphodel. Also Technopop. Thanks for ruining my life! <laughs> it's what I do. I heard a rumor that Annabeth is going to turn into a T-Rex. Thoughts? I hate it when vital information leaks. You're the reason I have trust issues. <laughs> Lol. Oh dear. Sorry about that. Who's Bojack Horseman? <laughs> he's, he's genuinely curious. Why do you kill most of my favorite characters? Why do you favor the characters I kill? Touché. You are my favorite author. Please keep shattering my emotional state with your books. Will do. Percy Jackson turned me into the bookworm I am today. Thank you, Uncle Rick. <laughs> no prob. I love turning people into worms. You were a total badass at school, weren't you? <laughs> totally. Alrighty, that is all I have for you today. If you want a part two, let me know in the comments. Hit like, hit subscribe, throw in a comment, do all that stuff. I love that stuff. Love you all. Okay, bye! <laughs>
Hello, friends. Shout out to Yamina Khan.